what's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Michael Ray Haybauer, coming to you from my hallway. I don't know why people do videos and talk from the kitchen floor, the bathroom, like I do at times, or hallways. Maybe it's because the lighting is above you. It looks good. It looks a little bit clean compared to the hoarding up that everybody does in their living rooms or their bedrooms or wherever you got. I don't know. Do me a favor, hit that thumbs up, that like, that subscribe button. Consider becoming a member of this channel for more content, exclusive content, members only, live streams coming, podcasts coming, and a bunch of other stuff to support me. I appreciate you. I love you. We got merchandise on shell. Links down below. It will be updated, but I don't want to give you all my problems. Basically, let's just call myself lazy. But I haven't been getting to it as of much lately, and I'm not feeling so hot right now. And I had a rough couple of weeks, emotional-wise, whatever, anxiety-wise, depression-wise, life-wise. But it's an exciting time. And I hope the clickbaited title gets your attention. Because I just had a fantasy revealed and done to me. Well, not really. I'm talking about fantasy football. It's fantasy football time, and my league is coming back for a 14th year. That's right, my private home league called Hollywood Hardcore Fantasy Football League is coming for a 14th year. Everybody signed up. We It cost a lot of money. It's like a $5,000 prize. No, that's not $5,000. So it's like a $3,000 prize pool, and it might be more than that. But it's a lot of money to play. It's around 250 to play. And I'm just proud and I'm excited because you guys know I love football. I'm wearing the t-shirt as of a former champion on many occasions. The t-shirt's a little bit messed up. We gotta order more. But every champion gets a t-shirt. And we're going into our 14th year. And I am the four-time champ. That's right, I'm going for a fifth title. We've had the league 14 years, and I've been to seven championships. I've won four of them, and I've only missed the playoffs twice. That's a good record. I'm the Tom Brady of fantasy football, let's be honest with you. But I'm proud, I'm trying to get excited. The league is back, but unfortunately, we used to do it live in person with a draft board for many years. But then 2020 hit. I'm not even going to say the word of that thing, fluvid. But that hit, and then we all were forced to do it online. And we tried to do it one year, but it just, people have moved out of town. People have moved with their family. They work internationally during this time of the season. And it seems like an impossibility to get everybody together again to have the camaraderie, the fun, to draft live. So now we're getting drunk and doing it online. Um, and here, here's a little funny story. I don't normally drink. I, I don't consider myself an alcoholic like my family members and other people. But um, I drink basically maybe twice a year. And one of them is for the Raiders and draft day and maybe the home opener and at draft time. And I didn't drink last year, but a couple of years back, I drank for two years while we did it online. Like I had some, some wine or whatever I drank, uh, some Miller High Life. And I got drunk or buzzed, and I drafted my team online. And I won the championship every year I was drunk. <laughs> Go figure. So now I'm thinking about getting drunk this year while we're drafting online. I mean, if it works, why stop it? I didn't drink last year. I didn't even make the playoffs. I don't know. Just funny little story. But hey, man, we got the, we got the, the trophy here. Again, we've been going for a lot of years. You got to fix a couple things up. But hey, I love it. And uh, the league is about to start again this year. And I just wanted to give you guys a video, give you an update with my life. And let you know that I'm excited. Um, 
and I wanted to share with you a vlog video that I made a couple of years back. It's probably been four or five years, but it was, it was when I was editing and able to edit on my computer and do some better things. But uh, <laughs> I just wanted you guys to share in the experience and some of the funnest moments in my life because that's what we're all seeking right now is through all the tragedy around the world is fun moments, love and respect and good times. And yeah, I just want to relive these moments and these instances. And I wanted to share with you guys. You guys are my friends, my family, basically. And I hope you enjoy the vlog that I made a few years back. And I'm hoping to get some more editing stuff in the, the coming month. Got a lot of plans, but it's hard to get all these plans rolling when my body breaks down or family stuff happens and then I get depressed or anxiety or I'm not feeling good. It's really tough, but I'm not here to complain about all that. I'm just here to give the good times and the good vibes. And I wanted to say, if any of you want to play fantasy football with me on FanDuel, and I do have another league on Sleeper, there might be one spot available it's a $50 league auction draft. So if you're interested, hit me up on social media, on Twitter or Facebook or Instagram in my DMs about the Sleeper League. The draft is this Friday, so you got to get on it. But that place will be filled. But if you also want to play FanDuel against me, I'm going to make a league or something on FanDuel for a weekly contest where we can gamble every week for a couple of dollars. So watch all of these videos. And the contest to join FanDuel and to battle me that week of the football season will be in every video in the description. So check that down below, guys. If you guys want to battle me one week, pick a team, and we go head-to-head -head for 5 bucks or 10 bucks or whatever it is. It's probably going to be $5 a game. But hey, man, that'll be a way for us to connect and have a good time. And that being said, I've already talked too much. I love you guys. I'll have another video in the coming days, but for now, let's watch my fantasy football vlog from a few years back, and I want you guys to see the fun, the exuberant, the beautiful, lively Michael Ray Bauer. Also, for members only, I'm going to probably update a video where I'm going to show you an entire two hours of video of my fantasy football leagues, you know, behind the scenes, not in edited content for multiple years, and I'm going to edit that for members only in the days ahead, so if you guys want to become a member and check that out, I call them home movies, maybe you guys like home movies, I don't know, but let me know, that being said, let's enjoy this fantasy football vlog, and I think I'm going to talk conspiracies in the next video, I hope I don't get flagged, I hope I don't get kicked off of YouTube just for talking, but we're going to talk about Hawaii on my next video. So expect that in a couple of days. Members only will get it a day or two early. So consider becoming a member for a couple of bucks. Help your boy out. I love you. God bless. And enjoy some fantasy football fun. Because it's football time, baby. Go Raiders. What's up? What's up, internet people? I tried to hold that note because I thought it was cool. Well, guess what today is? Today is Saturday. Basically the weekend, my favorite weekend of the year. You guys like it? I, I had to dye my little gray, cut myself shaving. But I'm looking good. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. I'm looking real good. So fresh, so clean. Well, it's my favorite weekend of the year. I love football. I love fantasy football. And I have drafts all day today on Saturday online for, you know, some other leagues that I run. Then I got my friends coming over, some actors, producers, directors, writers, editors. We have a private fantasy football league that we all pay upwards of $500 to play. That's right. Here's our trophy, but the real trophy is the money in the ring. Yeah, there's a ring involved, but it's a $50 cheapy ring. Let's just have a good weekend. Life is beautiful. 
I'm so happy. I'm feeling real good. And I love you all. So go on this little adventure with me. Because this is my fantasy football adventure. We do it big. We even make t-shirts. Let me show some of these to you guys. These are the basic t-shirts when you're in the league. See, Hollywood Hardcore. If you're a champion, you get a you get a special shirt to prove you're a champion. See, they are the awesome black shirts. And look, they say the same thing, but in the back, it's got your last name and the year you won the championship. Hey, Mikey, why do you have a Christmas tree hat and a Raider jersey? Because, first off, it's game day. Fourth preseason game versus the Sea Chickens. Your Raiders are playing them. And also, it's Christmas to me. Because fantasy football is two days away. Yeah! I got my draft board and everything set up for my league on Sunday. Now I go online and draft all day. I'm ready, baby. Yeah. We got our first guest. What up? Wear Raider gear, baby. That's right. Gotta be That's right. What up, Victor? What's up, man? What's going on? My boy, Victor. What up? He's drafting for Raphael because Raphael had family <laughs> yeah. on draft day. Send that to him. I will. Yeah, believe me, he'll see it. It's time for fantasy tips from Michael Rappaport. Uh, in all seriousness, if your fantasy draft interferes with your job in any way, shape, or form, quit your job. You think me, lady. There's, there's other jobs, all right? If your daughter has a ballet, who cares? Get your mind right. There's other ballets. There's one fantasy draft. All right? You'll thank me later. Trust me. Ballets. You want to go to a ballet? You really want to go to a ballet? Go ahead and knock yourself out. What up? What up? What are you, what are you guys going to do today? Finish 8th and 9th? I'm going to go first place. How can a loser get first place? And who's this? What's up? Show, show the Raider Nation what you wore today. Ha! Victor, you know what that means, right? Yeah. Yeah, exactly. It's just whatever, dude. No, dude, no. Dude. You getting ready? Getting ready, man. My friend Bo brought me a birthday gift a year late, but I still love him for hey, it. It's only like six months, right? And let's see what he got me. Oh, I already know what it is. It's the Raider Nation flag. I already know what it is. I don't even have one. You don't have one? Yeah. No, I have a Raider Nation flag, but not this one. Oh, wait, I do. You have that one? I do. <laughs> now, but, you, now you got two of hey, them. Hey, but I got two now. So when I travel... You put it on your car? No, I thank you. I love it. I think it's yeah, fucking great. Right? Uh, I love it. On, your fucking... on the hood? Thank you, Bo Barrett. You're welcome. For the Raider Nation flag. Even though you're a poser with that McFadden shirt. Our league showing up. Say what's up, Rob. What's up? We got the first girl in the league. What up? We needed some, what's the opposite of testosterone? Estrogen. We needed some estrogen in this league. So thank you, Laura. What up? And how dare you disrespect this house with a Ram jersey. It's going to be a long season. Lada, da 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 We got the league going. So? We're going to start this draft in a few minutes. Enjoy. Demarcus Williams, University of Georgia. T.J. Jackson, Wayne State University. Tavares Smith King, Merrimack College. Tal Royal, Smoochie Wallace, University of Miami. Desquarius Green Jr., University of Notre Dame. Ibrahim Moises, University of Tennessee at Chattanooga. Jack Marius Tack Theratrix, Michigan State University. The Isaiah T. Billings Clyde, Coastal Carolina University. The Jasper Probenkruck III.
So at the draft board, making his pick is Dingleberry. Dingleberry 20. Explain to everybody where that jersey came from. We're on video now. This is NFL Direct from the NFL. Official. Official Chinese, right? 20. See, if you guys noticed, it said 20 in the front, four on the sides, and the colors were wrong. So it's an official NFL Chinese jersey. <laughs> What's going on is the guy that's picking, he always takes like 25 minutes to pick. So we're going to watch him do his process because he's never ready. So let's enjoy this. It's like we're in nature and we're watching a wild animal do a fantasy draft. Let's watch. As he eyes its prey, <laughs> his eyes single in on a certain target, but that target was picked 10 minutes ago and he didn't realize it. So you stop it. He is now on the clock. He is now making a move. What's happening? What's going on? Oh, no, that was just a false alarm. Oh, you're actually recording all this shit? Yes. Damn. He struggles with his picks. Let's watch him do his work. There's nothing else we can do, though. Right, 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 right. Richard Matthews. He's made a pick. What shall we witness? Remember the procedure. Remember the procedure. Remember the procedure. Remember the procedure. He, he's not even doing the procedure. You gotta mark it out on the left. Hard at work. Or hardly working. All that for Duke Johnson? I'm gonna come for his time. Rob, all that for Duke Johnson? Sorry. Explain your pick to the people that are fantasy experts out there. There's no rhyme or reason for it. So then just pick anybody. <laughs> you took seven minutes for Duke Johnson in round five. You leave me Why, thank you. For oh, shit. my bad. <laughs> Eli Manning. Oh, he's a Giants fan, too. You could've got him in it. Look at that. Giants fan. Pick up Eli Manning. I can't risk that shit. All right. Becky with the good hair is up next. <laughs> Does anybody know where that's from? Thank you. That's Becky with the good hair. Her nickname is Icebox O'Shea. Icebox, who'd you get? Who'd you get, Icebox? Deshaun! Didn't want to go to the Raiders, Jackson. We're in our like seventh hour and we're all burned out, but we're having a great time. And he's filming me film him. He's still making his picks. He needs to find a good kicker. I'm not just setting my lineup. He's setting his lineup in his own mind, but you know, his lineup will suck eventually. Then we got this dude down here. Broke his leg during the draft. <laughs> and you know, it's been a real tough day. And I just want to let all the Beyonce fans out there know, I found Becky with the good hair. Becky with the good hair. This is Becky with the good hair. What's up? We found, we just found out he has a internet porn video up there. He's a porn director. As you can see from his outfit, he's got the whole Rams gear on, the shades. So I told you my league was full of actors, celebrities, and all that. But I meant porn directors and and <laughs> Becky with the good hair and people like that. I got D-list celebrities, everybody, in my league. I'm a D-list 1990s actor who probably is never going to work again, but I accept that, and that's okay. I can deal with that, can you? That's why I'm on YouTube. I had a few beers, had a good time. I'm a little weird, so hey, it happens. Okay, so it's been eight hours. The draft started at two, it's now 10 p.m. 
We've been going for eight hours and we're at the final pick. So I think everybody here is really freaking excited. Uh, we're gonna do the final pick. Woo! So let's see if we can basically... All right, so we're here at the final pick of the draft. After eight hours of bullshit, which we talked about already, I just got my kicker, Sebastian Janikowski, and we're at the final pick. Check out the board. You guys see that? And now, the ultimate bitch of the draft is about to walk and pick the final pick because he's a loser. Are you making a pick? Who's the last pick, sir? Matt. Uh, Matt, Matt, uh, Matt Prater, please. Well, I don't know who he wants, but apparently it's Matt. It's Matt. Oh, yeah, it's the top of the morning to you. Matt Prater is the final pick of the Hollywood Hardcore Fantasy Football League's sixth inaugural year, and we finally got women! We finally got women in our league! So all you girls out there that want to join my league, yes, let me know. I'm not freaky at all. We don't have crazy sex parties. We have berries and nuts and whipped cream. Is that a party? I don't know. All right, let's do the final pick. It is Matt Prater. And there's our draft board. It is officially over. We did it. There we go. Now we can go get drunk, eat chicken wings, and I don't know, whatever you all want to do. Let me know. I'll be live for three hours. I had a few beers, had a good time. I'm a little weird. So, hey, it happens. I'm literally in a football hangover, not from drinking from fantasy football drafting. It took like 10 hours. I had a long weekend, but a fun weekend. Many of you guys might not like this vlog, but hey, this is my life. This is my fantasy football adventure.